Welcome to our exciting deep dive into the world of Raspberry Pi. Today, we're comparing the boot times of the Raspberry Pi 4 and the new Raspberry Pi 5 using three different setups, SD card, USB NVMe, and PCIe. Let's see how the latest model stacks up against its predecessor. First, let's talk about our testing methodology. We measured the boot time from the moment power was applied until the system reached the Raspberry Pi OS desktop. Both models were equipped with active cooling to prevent any heat-related performance drops. Active cooling with small fans mounted on heat sinks ensures that both CPUs can operate at their best without throttling. To ensure stable power, we used the Citron 27 Watt PD USB-C Universal Power Adapter for both setups. Now, let's dive into the setups we tested. First up, SD card boot. Both the Raspberry Pi 4 and Raspberry Pi 5 were booted using a high-capacity Citron Maker Disk 32GB micro SD card pre-installed with the latest Raspberry Pi OS 64-bit full version. For the Raspberry Pi 4, the boot time was approximately 35 seconds. In contrast, the Raspberry Pi 5 booted up in about 21 seconds. That's a significant improvement. Next, we tested USB boot with an NVMe drive. Using a USB 3.0 to NVMe adapter, the Raspberry Pi 4 clocked in at around 38 seconds. The Raspberry Pi 5, with its faster USB interface and powerful CPU, managed to boot in about 27 seconds. Finally, we explored PCIe boot. The Raspberry Pi 5 supports both PCIe Gen 2 and Gen 3. Using a PCIe Gen 2 NVM setup, it booted in approximately 16 seconds. Switching to PCIe Gen 3 shaved off an additional second, resulting in a boot time of 15 seconds. Here's a quick summary of our results. The Raspberry Pi 5's advanced processor, faster USB interface, and PCIe capabilities clearly provide a substantial improvement in boot times. Whether you're using an SD card, USB NVMe, or PCIe, the Raspberry Pi 5 delivers a quicker startup. In terms of price to performance, the Raspberry Pi 5 offers excellent value, especially for tasks requiring quick startup and data access. It's a worthwhile investment for those seeking the fastest boot times and enhanced system performance. Thanks for joining us in this boot time showdown between the Raspberry Pi 4 and Raspberry Pi 5. Be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more exciting Raspberry Pi content. See you next time.